kids forget about everything else when they're having fun. This is what their mother was hoping for, I guess. Yeah, I think so. We've all got to hold on to what we can. She gave her life for this. For her kids to have something to look forward to. The kids are going to find out the truth one day. What then? Believe me. Sometimes a little lie and a little hope is more powerful than the hard truth. Rookie, today's mission is gonna be very tricky as well. We need to track down a patient named Haley. She should have just waited by the Raven's lab, but she decided to leave instead. She's gotten herself into a very dangerous position. She has a severe illness that may cause a massive psychological break. If that happens, she won't be able to distinguish friend from foe. Her illness is also highly contagious. One wrong move and we may find ourselves facing thousands of Haley's. The report shows that she and her husband, Arthur, have a very good relationship. We should ask him if he knows where Haley is. Let's move when you're ready. It, damn you! Get away from my car! Sir, let me help. Can't you see, kid? I can handle things by myself. Sir, I'm worried that the sound of those gunshots just now might draw even more zombies here. I'll feel a lot better having an extra person around. Okay. Looks like my ride's busted. I better fix it ASAP or I'll be walking to the seaside. <laughs> uh, come on, youngin. Give me a hand here. Hold him off, kid. Relax, sir. I'll handle it. A little more to go. Then let's get going. Oh, yeah. You're with the Ravens, aren't you? Hmm. I guess you wanted to ask me about Haley's whereabouts, right? I'm getting old, but I'm not senile. You know, when the Ravens found us and said they might be able to treat Haley... I'm really sorry, sir. I believe that the Ravens have really tried their best. I don't intend to blame the Ravens. After all, it's not like you made her get sick. Right now... All I want to do is fulfill my promise. Haley is... You can come... Come on, youngin. It's getting late. Let's get moving.
Haley will be worried. Let's speed things up. You must love her very much. Mm, sure do. She's the kindest woman I ever met. I was a truck driver, so I wasn't at home much. Haley raised our two daughters almost completely on her own. I regret not spending more time with them, though. I should have been a better man. Oh, I, I just remembered. I've prepared some gifts. You gotta be safe on your first adventure, right? I remember that camp up ahead used to have a gift store. Maybe you can find something there. How's it going over there, newbie? Haley's husband, Arthur, has promised to take me to search for Haley. But we need to go to the seaside. I heard Arthur's a wily old man. I hope he doesn't have any tricks up his sleeve. Relax. Mr. Arthur seems very sincere to me. I don't think he's a bad guy. Time waits for no one. Haley's situation could get out of hand at any moment. Be careful. Haley's gonna love these. Sir, there's a noise coming from the back of the car. No, no, you, you must be imagining things. I can't hear anything. Oh, we'll be at the coast soon, kid. Why did your wife want to go to the seaside? Kids grow up and then, you know, work is work. They get married and then they were all gone. Haley often gets lonely. She loved staring at this picture of the sea. That's why I promised to take her there. But, you know, work and all. Later, later, I always told her. Peter never came, but the zombies did. Haley got ill, and I never kept my promise. Remember this, kid. If you love someone, never tell them. No, later. Are we there, sir? Haley? <sighs> We're here, kid. There's one last thing you can do. Go and pick me a bunch of flowers from over there. And you can take Haley. These blue flowers are a bit uninspiring. I should go find some different ones. These red flowers look really nice. I'm sure Arthur and his wife will love them. Heavens! It's an explosion! What has Arthur done? He must have left something. I'll need to look around.
Beauty fades, but a promise lasts forever. Arthur was a headstrong old guy, wasn't he? He certainly was. It's a real shame. He was willing to risk his life to keep a promise. Something tells me he'll be keeping his promises, even in the next life, with Haley by his side forever. Thank you. 